Okay, I'm back. I just wanted to show you I found diamonds. Yes, finally, finally. <laughs> but, of course, I don't have my iron pickaxe. So what I'm going to do is I'm just going to... I'm just gonna mine around this and go back up and make one and then I'll be back to get the diamonds. Oh, finally it took forever. Let's do this. I'm gonna leave that there as well and here we go. That took forever. It usually doesn't take that long to find diamonds either. Uh, usually, um, we dig our diamond mine, we go down, go down the first row, boom, diamonds. But this time, like I said, it took forever. This is my second diamond mine too. Okay, oh, here we go. I can't believe I'm not that prepared. Oh, everything looks pretty nice. Not so much going on. That's just a strange looking house to me. Yeah, I, yeah, I don't know. There's my doggies, hello doggies. Guess what, we found diamonds, we found diamonds. All right, so, oh, see, they're even happy. Um, Where do I have my iron? Oh, let's see, uh, I don't remember. Nope, not there. I need sticks first. Of course, I'm probably already going to have to make planks. Ah, it's not there. That's rude. My gosh. I moved everything around and I can't find anything. Okay, nope. Not there. Of course, it's probably one of the last ones I'm looking in. Ah, there we go. There's the iron. And I just need some planks. Okay looking good. What else do I need while I'm down there? Inventory is so full. I really don't need all this cobblestone. So I'm going to put it back. And then I'm going to go back down there and get my diamonds. Once I get my diamonds, I'll be able to obviously um, create an obsidian maker. Uh, you need a diamond pickaxe to, to get the obsidian. So let's see. Anything else? Just get rid of some of this stuff. I know, doggies. I know, I know. But here we go. Make sure there's no creepers around. Okay. Oh. Now you see I've got uh, one of these days. I'll show you the garden again. But we've got the pumpkin. we got the... Um, what do you call that? Sugar cane? Oh, but I want to show you Tessa's house real quick. Look. So, it's coming along really nice. Um, I have to admit, well, she likes a lot of light. <laughs> she doesn't want anything. But this looks nice. Um, not sure why her bed's there. And this is a nice little cozy room. Hi, doggy. Aw. Unfortunately, she never did find another one. So, she's probably just going to have that one. It's just really sad. Alright, and this, I don't really know how I'm supposed to get over. Oh. I don't like trapdoors, but that's just me. When I'm in a hurry, I want to just be able to get up, and those are cumbersome, if you ask me. Okay. It's very pretty. Very pretty. Um, guess I'll close her doors for her. And now back to the diamond mine. But as I was saying, the garden, so now we have pumpkin, we have sugar cane, we have wheat, and carrots. Just look, need watermelon. There's no jungle, so I'll probably never get cocoa beans. And there is, uh, let's see, watermelon, cocoa beans, and potatoes. The one little small little, um, gosh, the village, you know, it just had carrots. Usually it has potatoes too, but mm, not this time. Okay, going back down to get my diamonds. Diamonds, diamonds, diamonds. Ooh, monsters. I usually go towards the monsters because to me that just says, hey, there's something here. Come get me, come check it out. Oh, where? There we go. Ah, I don't really need all the redstone, but here we go, diamonds, yay. Here we go. 
three, four, five, six, it looks like. As long as there's no lava underneath there. Okay, and I get some iron too. Bonus. Oh, is that coal? Okay, not too bad. Not too bad, if I say so myself. I really want to um, really explore more of the things I can make with redstone. Sometimes the things that people make are, they're a lot cumbersome. They're like over the top with the redstone. But, um, you know, with the repeaters and all that, I've done a couple things. Ike has helped me um, make like a door, like, you know, with the code and everything. And, you know, it was cool. I mean, anybody can get in, though, by breaking the codes and stuff if you really want it in bad enough. But, you know, still, it's pretty neat. Maybe my next adventure I will um, explore. Just nothing but that. And you know me. I have to fill everything in. You know, it won't be balanced. Because I'm still mining down here. Oh, gotta get that last piece. What am I waiting for? Cool, cool. I am happy. Like I said, that took a long time. Yep, just gonna fill this in and eventually make that diamond pickaxe, like I said. I need to make an enchantment table. Uh, once I go to the nether portal, get everything I need for, gosh, I don't know, just everything. Okay. So, I think that is probably it for now. mining uh, later. Well, maybe I'll just, I don't know. Sometimes it's just so hard to decide. Maybe I'll mine a little bit down another time. Yeah, let me just clear this out a little bit more. That way I'm all set up for the next So in the other uh, tunnel, the first one that we started with, there's still a cave that Tess and I need to go explore. So we're going to do that. Now one of the spawners, the zombie spawner that um, we found, <laughs> you know, uh, Ike says, believe it or not, he wants to make a, a trap. You know, he wants to make a X XP farm, you know, basically. I found a simple way to do it. To me, he tried one time and it was so elaborate, <laughs> it just, I just didn't get it. And you guess what? He never finished it. So I think it was too elaborate for him too. But I'm going to let him. So he'll be on at some point and um, I'll let him do his thing. Maybe I'll be down there with him in case there's monster spawning and, you know, I'll keep them off of him he does his thing but like I said his to me is just more complicated than it needs to be but that's just me okay so we'll set this up man I need some light here it's too dark we'll count two over and then this is where we start finish off my cobblestone pickaxe go a little bit and see what we have. Ah, this is not going to work. i got to set this up. These things have to be in place. Shovel. Light. There you go. Diamond, diamond, diamond. I usually will dig a 
as far on the top as I can because, um, you know, lava could be there and you really don't want it coming out at you. So I just go to the top first and then I dig far back so that if there is lava, one, I don't fall on it, two, it doesn't get on me. So that's what I usually do. a monster spawn behind me, but every once in a while I feel creeped out and I will, uh, I'll put a, br a block behind me. So, I'm just going to do this for a little bit and be back with you. Now, when we do eventually go to fight the nether dragon, I I have a, all, it's all a complete diamond armor, and it's enchanted, so that tells you <laughs> that I'll play a lot for a while, because I have never gone in without anything like that. I probably could, but I just think it's like suicide. And I tell you, Tess is so good with her bow and arrow. So when she's shooting the um, towers, you know, she's, she's, we pretty much don't have to climb all of them. I'm the climber typically, and she usually takes her bow and arrow and she'll get the ones that she can. I've devised like a system on those ones that have the crate around them. Crate? I don't know what you call those. The grate probably. Um, so I'll set myself up and I'll put bricks all the way around it and then when it explodes because I'm up there hitting it with a um, pickaxe then and I'm always knocked backwards oh that's not gonna work Turn my face gotta fill in that hole um, then I'm not you know thrown off <laughs> so it, it works oops I think I've been playing too long uh, yeah I tell you, this time b goes by really, really fast. But the Ender Dragon's far off, and like I said, this this world, there's a very good chance they didn't. <laughs> I don't know. I don't want to say that it's not in. You know, we'll never find the Nether Portal. But I tell you, there's a lot of things missing here. One desert, two jungle. So we shall see. I said, I don't really know how to, ooh, blue stuff, how to, um, okay, no, I need my iron pickaxe, how to feed them, I know, I know we've given them haystacks before, but, um, I don't know, I guess I'll figure it out, alright, I think that's just about enough, 
I said I think it's being really really stingy so a little bit more nothing nothing come on diamonds 